Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. We're here again with Europa Universalis 3 Divine Wind. Death and Taxes, still 7.7. .7 because they're not going to fix anything else in version 7, they're going to keep working on version 8. Which is fine, it just sucks because we are stuck using version 7.7 .7 for this Let's Play. And if there's anything still terribly wrong with it, too bad. Tough shit. Anyway. Let's hop back in with Shia. And take a look. Let's see, 5.7 infamy. Good prestige. Good money. 230 money a year. Nice. We're not minting enough. Bring it up to like 20. Uh, 20 is a little high. Actually, 20 my yeah, 20 is right on the button. Good. Civility's fine. Land tech is fine. Uh, four more tech advances till we get government. Uh, the next idea. Then again, the next idea is not very crucial. Anything we take is not very crucial on on this stuff. I would like to get church attendance day because as we grow larger, it's going to take longer and longer to get our stability back. And I would also like to get patron of the arts because having to waste mag magistrates whenever we need a new uh, great man is a pain in the ass. I mean, I understand it, but, you know, these guys are going to die soon. All of them are. And I'm gonna, I want to replace all of them. So we're going to need a whole lot of culture tradition. That's just a lot of wasted magistrates. But if we get uh, patron of the arts, then it'll be a lot less strain. Anyway, let's put the speed up to four. And let's see, one, two, three... Alright, let's unpause. Man, our infamy limit is 7.4. And that's with almost perfect prestige. How's things going at our center of trade here? 920. That's nice. About over here. 1600. Yes, yes. Revolts. I get it. I get it. Oh, slaughter. Trading in China where happened to us. Good. Not like we need legitimacy, but still, good. Noble rebels. Who the hell's Shogun? Is it still... Daimyo. 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 Daimyo, Daimyo. Oh. I thought it would say Shogun if they were a Shogun. I guess it just says Daimyo no matter what. Ah, whatever. Hey, you want that marriage? From Japan? Nope. Whatever. Whatever. I do what I want. And yeah, we really do need to annex these guys. Especially Sean. If they can't support their own military, then they're useless. No. So we have truces until... 15, 1454. Alright. No leader. Well, that won't do.
Oh yeah, I need to rename this shit. We have Yi Chang, Yi Chang, and Yi Cheng. I'm gonna rename this to Chang. Chang. There you go. Yi Chang and Chang. This one. Uh There you go. Let's put it backwards. Perfect. It's now Ganechi. Oh. I guess the H and the C are backwards, huh? Whatever. I don't care. Oh. Discovering a lot more of Indonesia now. Not having a whole lot of luck here. Let's see if this guy is successful. Nice. Keep it up, Broskies. Oh, lots of temples. Good, good. Yeah, more temples, please. Why are you guys just sitting around? You guys even at war? No, you guys aren't at war at all. Are you guys at war? No. No. It's like nobody's at war around us right now, for some reason. Not even Mogulistan is at war. They're fucking a horde. Eh, whatever. Oh, 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 look at this, baby. We have a colonist. Alright, that means... First and foremost, we need another boat. Is that all we have is four core provinces on the coast? Yeah, we can only... <laughs> We can only build boats where we have cores, and we only have four cores. Alright, well that'll be... seven. That should be fine, actually. So we'll do that. But we'll queue up some more boats. Because I really need more than that. Uh-oh. Oh, it's not that bad. Almost a hundred thousand manpower. That is sweet. Yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna go colonize Taiwan, but we're gonna kill the natives first because I don't need them destroying our colony every couple years, which they would do. And we only get a colonist every ten years. So, oh, Khmer got that province back. Good job, Khmer. Aw, oh, really? One relation's too low? Our diplomat has died. Oh, god damn it. We really need him right now. Any diplomats on the market? Yep, there's a level one diplomat. 
Oh, fuck me. And now we bring the long and arduous process of regaining cultural tradition to get... Uh, oh, great. Poor government policies. Changes in policies when poorly timed and made were often wrongly perceived by the people of the time beyond their actual efficiency as a proof of the government's ill will and lack of interest in welfare in the realm. We have chosen the right path or lose a bunch of dollars that we don't have. So, yeah, we, we can't lose money that we don't have, so let's just... Best in stability. That really fucking sucks. That hurts a lot losing that diplomat. Where's my damn boats? Oh, and our army reformer dies the same same fucking day. Great. Fantastic. Turkestan. Somewhere over there. Six boats. We'll get one more. We'll split off seven guys. We'll take uh, we'll take all the horses and three soldiers. Come on, finish my boat. Alright, well we can replace our dudes with level 1s of each. Oh, level 4. There we go. Tiana 1, level 4. Perfect. And then a level 1 army reformer. <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, whatever. It's better than nothing. Alright. Guys are all grouped up. Let's take the 7,000 motherfuckers and head onto the boat. I'm a coming for you, Taiwan. All right, and they attack us right away. Of course they do. And they died. All right, <laughs> it's done. Back on the boat. That should be a really quick place to colonize, because it's just right off our coast. No. No access for you. We're not going to be able to colonize the Philippines, though, because we can't see them. Temples are done. Good, good. Let's get some more culture, tradition. <laughs> Go, little tree chopper. and <laughs> Chop that tree, yeah! You show that tree who's boss. Oh. Alright, success. Supplement 14, tax of 4. There's no natives, so well, there you go. And it's going to grow by 40 people every year. Cool.
wish I could turn off these requests for military access and just say auto decline if it's someone whose relations are poor like these guys who are keep, who keep asking their relations is negative 200 so of course I'm not going to accept it but they're gonna keep asking anyway Ah, I can replace our artist. Good. Because he was in our service for 50 years anyway. Might as well replace him. Sean has a standing army of zero. They keep building it and then deleting it because they can't fucking afford it. Diviet has a standing army of one. It was two a minute ago, but now they've reduce that army to one because two is too expensive. So vassals have been really weakened in this game to the point where they can't even support their own goddamn army. Like Tibet over here has 4,000 guys. Uh, I'm willing to bet within like six months they'll have zero just because they can't afford it. It's really just pain in the ass how that works. But what are you gonna do? What you gonna do? Still not done with stability. Oh yeah, stability's done. Yep, yep, there goes the naval slider again. God, I fucking hate that. That is a really annoying bug. Water friction on Pegu for Mool Main. Yeah, but not too interested, to be honest. Oh, that's right, we have that mission for Datong. How long until that embassy runs out? Oh, still at 25 years, good. There we go, Haichi Durkin's declared war on Song. And our truce is over. So we can go to war with Haichi whenever we want. We just can't take much territory. But that's fine. A war is a war, right? come and do whatever they want. They're all running around, because they're all allied together, all three of these guys. Oh, one of our generals has died. Let's fix that. No, 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 no. There. It's fixed. Whoa, level six alderman. Production efficiency. Hell yeah. Because if you check our income, we're getting most of our money from production. So a uh, 6% bonus to that is huge. Yep. Alright, you're ready to go. Let's actually go to Ningxia. Alright, you're just standing there, and you guys are coming over here. Not sure why you're marching all the way over there. Langzang Song, Mongo. Oh, they're going to the Mongol Khanate. Tianwan, Ayat, Haya, Champa, and Pegu. So Song has a lot of allies. Well, no, they don't. They're just allied with Langzang, right? Yeah, see, they're allied with Langzang. So Langzang took over leadership in the war, and they invited all of their allies. That's what happened. 
That's what happened. So yeah, keep coming. Keep bringing your armies. Just go right past me. I'm not here. You do not see me standing on your border. <laughs> Taking a little bit of attrition up here, so we're not going to wait forever. But we're going to let them get over there. Yes, yes, Manchu raids. Haha, <laughs> rebels. It's only 3,000 guys, though. Alright, so Champa and Ayadhaya have invaded these two provinces. So we should probably get this war going while it's hot. Chinese unification. Call our allies, of course they're going to join, because they're our fucking vassals. Yep, everyone joined on both sides, which is expected. Siege it. Not Gansu. Not Gansu. Oh, hello, Jerkins. Nineteen thousand. Damn it. I got there two days too late. Here, so that we chase them off to Helio Jong is the main army. They're actually both main armies, but that's the weaker one. So we'll follow that. The other one's going to Haichi over here. All right. So we'll try to kill that army up there. No stability or gain plutocracy. Uh, I'm fine with plutocracy. Four two one. Do I have a better general? Four four one. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right, we're under attack. They have a negative five penalty though. Our problem is we have low morale right now. Chill then. 
And one up here, they're running to Sanching. Where the hell is Sanching? Over here, okay. Kill that army. You guys are running to here. Actually, we will let you land, because that'll be funny. Nope, they changed their minds. They're running to Shia Noyan over there. Alright. Then we can relax right here. Actually, let's go kill them. Then we'll come kill them. Alright, we killed that army in Sanxing. That was... Uh, Wild Jerkin's only army. So, they may want peace now. No, really? That was your only army, my friend. <laughs> oh well. Might as well siege it while we're here. Now do you want peace? Yeah, you'll give me all your money now. Can make him spit out jerkin. I don't see any point, but uh, whatever. Can make him get rid of their alliances, but that wouldn't matter. Okay. So we have released a country called Jerkin. They are not Jiangsu, they are not Heiji, they are not wild, they are just jerkin. And they will join our war. Sounds good. Why don't you guys head uh, this away? Actually, no, let's get these guys out of the war. We'll stomp them a bit. coming to attack me. Sounds like a winning plan. Let's put our best general up there. Actually, no, you can stay with that general. He should be fine. Okay, we've arrived. We'll wait for the end of the month. Get our morale up. And there's that big battle kicking off. Check it out in a second. Nice. Now let's see, do they want out of the war? Yes. Alright, let's get some dollars out of them. Oh, they won't give us any dollars. That's fine, we'll just white piece them out of the war. That way we only have to deal with the uh, Heiji. Okay. You guys come this way. And we'll check out this big battle here. Okay, they're pieced out. Let's go deal with them, and then we'll come up here. Actually, let's come up here first, and then we'll go deal with them. There we go, we won that. And we're faster than they are, so we should be able to chase them down. No, they're faster than us. Really? This guy's got three maneuver, but he's going to arrive four days before we do. Wow. That is one fast motherfucker. All right, we'll go down there. We'll send this guy up to Nerchinsky to deal with him. Okay, you guys should come back home and start healing up. Just go to Beijing. That's why we have all this manpower, right? White piece, let me guess. Oh no, he wants to give us 40 bucks. Well, how generous of you.
7th of March. Let's go this way. Oh, we probably can't because we're not at war anymore. Well, we'll try anyway. Damn it, one of our leaders died. Oh, it still lets us go through their territory. Interesting. And we are not... Oh, yeah, we are going to catch them. Excellent. We're going to barely, barely catch them. Good. Negative one penalty, though. Yeah, we got a core province. Very nice. We won up there. Good. Oh, yeah, they have a leader with, like, six maneuver or something, because we can't catch them. All right, we're pretty much full health. So let's start the invasion. Guy's way too fast. Sure, we'll get a core on song, that's fine. And let's waste our magistrates on... Well, I guess we don't really need an extremely good infamy guy, but I would love one better than four. Is there a better one on the market? No. Alright, well fuck it, let's just build some buildings then. Oh, Duren. Cool. Oh, cool. Actually, why don't you just go home? I don't think I need anyone else up there. Fail. Nope, oh, we got it. Cool. All right, everyone start going home. Sixty four per cent. We can take six provinces. Oh, they will. That's pretty much all I wanted from them anyway, but that's 12 infamy? Oh, because something up here may, must not be part of China, huh? It's Ordos. Ordos was not part of China. Okay. That one wasn't either. That one is. And that one is. Okay, so... 
Wow, I thought uh, Ordos was part of it, but I guess not. Okay, then. Then I guess we do have to come down here and take these two. So we'll have to wait for that war to end before we get peace. Or we could just take those four and get out of the war. Oh my god, we actually made them run away. So that's the Chinese region. So Bayanhat, Datong, Liaodong, Xinyang. So it doesn't really extend into Manchuria, that's its own region. And this was considered the Mongol Empire, even Ordos, I'm surprised. Oh well. Okay, we destroyed their army, that's excellent. Okay, let's finish this up. Oh, they still have an army of 10,000. I don't know what they were doing earlier, but there you go. You know what we can do? We can just piece these guys out, and then we can go to war with Song. Why not? Alright, so let's send you guys down here. You guys come down here. Let's go sit in Beijing, I guess. You're still allied with Lanzong and Tianwan. Lanzong is definitely going to be the leader in that war, so we're going to be at war with a lot of shit if we go to war with Song. But what are you going to do? What are you going to do?
And it's not like we can take any of their land. Because... Yeah, it's just not going to work. Because they're losing that war right now. Alright, let's just peace out. Take our four provinces that are super cheap. And, uh... Yeah, we're not going to be able to handle infamy if we go... If we take one more province. Like, that's four infamy. Just for that one province. So we're not going to be able to handle it. So let's just peace out. Make them spit out. Jin... Joseon, Oirat. You can make him spit out Yuan. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, let's do that, because we don't have any truce with Yuan. That's perfect. We can go to war with Yuan. Oh, but we don't have Chinese unification on Yuan, do we? No, we don't. Okay. We'll do that. Get rid of your cores on that shit. I don't care about those. Don't care about your treaty. Ah, yeah, sure. Get rid of your treaty. And that's it. Alright, Yuan is free. Let's dissolve that alliance. Tribal conquest on Yuan. Hadn't even thought of that, but that's definitely a possibility. Tribal conquest. Alright, let's navigate you guys over this away. So we got our core into Tong. What's our next mission? Conquer Mulmain. We must recover the lands that are rightfully part of our nation. Conquest against Pegu. So if we do that, we'll get a core on Mulmain. do that. Can I cancel the mission? Yeah, cancel the mission. Give me a better mission. Protect our brethren in Hengshu. Oh, come on. I can't go to war with them forever. It wants me to take this province, but I can't go to war with them for five years. Fucking hell, gang. Give me a mission I can do. Oh, well. Song's gonna get annexed by the Jiangsu Jerkins anyway. So there's no extreme rush. We do need to insult these guys, though. 